Hello, everybody. I'm Quentin Randall. I'm here at Medelta with the lovely and talented Annette Tenkata, ceramic artist extraordinaire. Annette, you have an exhibition here at Medelta in the Ewell Family Gallery. Can you tell me, before we get into the show, um, how you ended up in, in Medicine Hat and, and uh, what you've been doing at Medelta for the past little while? Sure. Uh, well, I came here from Guelph, Ontario. I was studying ceramics at Sheridan College in Oakville, uh, Oakville Ontario. And uh, I, so I drove over here a year ago. It took me five days. <laughs> and uh, it was a great drive, by the way. But um, I, I got into the residency program here, the uh, International Artist in Residence program, which is next door to us. So it was so exciting to, to get here. And uh, it's been an awesome year. So I've been working on this show for the past year. Yeah. And yeah. So, so what can you tell me about this show? Because it's, it's, it's ceramic art, but it's not pottery. It's, uh, there's, there's a lot of figures behind you, and this show is, is um, I don't know, is it, what is it capturing, and where did the inspiration for this show come from? Sure. Uh, well, the inspiration for the show came from, um, I was at this event, and I had met these people. And it was really, like, I had this great conversation with them, and it was lovely to do that. And they were about uh, maybe 18 years old. And I noticed that as soon as the camera came out, that everybody sort of changed for the camera. These 18-year-old girls that were very sort of sweet and lovely, they all of a sudden put on these poses that were just sort of very, really forced and, uh, and kind of a little bit pro provocative. And I thought, this is interesting, the way the camera changes us so much. And I know that it does for me as well in different ways. And then I thought about traditional poses that we, that we do in front of the camera. And so really, it was a, a reaction um, to the way we change in front of the camera. So that, that was the inspiration for these pieces. That's awesome. And so what, how has Medelta helped facilitate this, this, um, this exhibition and all this artwork coming to life? Yeah, Medelta has been amazing. Uh, I've been able to work uh, to dedicate my time to this show for a whole year. And I don't know that I could have done anything like this without having that time and all the facilities and the support here are, is just huge. You just feel very supported as a clay artist. There's lots of other people from all over the world here to, you know, to bounce ideas off of, to talk about your work. Uh, you just get really comfortable talking about what you want to do. And then you have the time and the space and the equipment and the opportunity to show it. It's a place like Medelta just is really exceptional for someone who is is trying to get your work out and trying to get trying to get out there. Right. So. Awesome. And so, on top of this exhibition of of ceramic sculpture, I understand you're also a graphic designer. And so, can you just kind of talk about how that has influenced you and how that maybe has worked its way into this exhibition and into your artwork? Yes. Uh, so I, I worked as a graphic designer for. Um, almost 20 years before, before getting into ceramics. And ceramics is always something I was really interested in. But um, because I have this background in graphics, I love Photoshop and Illustrator and InDesign. And so I wanted to somehow merge the two together because it just felt like a way that I could di diversify my audience. I could, I could reach a lot more people if I had a print element to my work as well. So um, one of the reasons, like in this show, you'll see lots of print as well. I wanted to put uh, the figures that I made into a photographic context and into a background that made them more, more interesting. And um, so that's what I've been doing with the graphics. And I, I really want to continue on that way. I, I would love to explore children's books and other print materials, other ways to, to make the, my ceramic work get out there a little bit more and see where that leads. So Cool. So one of the pieces here that's really interesting to me is um, there's a white frame here with an orange background. Oh, yes. Um, and there's nothing behind it. So can you kind of talk about that? Because that's kind of a, it's just, it seems like a fun thing and a way for people to maybe be involved in it. So can you kind of talk about that? Uh, that's exactly the idea. I wanted people to get involved. So when, uh, at the opening, the frame was, was up and I wanted people to sort of look and see the way we, we pose in front of the camera and uh, interact with the pieces, but then also have an opportunity with the frame to do their own still life and to see how they may change or, or what happens to them when they're behind the frame and getting a photograph taken. So that was the idea behind that. And it was really successful the night of. There were lots of people that had their photograph taken. And I'm noticing that the show's been up for a month now. and people keep on using that frame and I just love that so it's been a success the frame <laughs> cool no that's a great idea um, 
I think that's all I have. Do you have anything else that you wanted to add? I just wanted to add that Medelt has been such a huge support to me, and I feel like this year has been the best year ever, and uh, I could have never done anything like this without, without the support of a place like this, so right I'm on. really grateful. Right on. Mm -hmm. so thanks for watching, everybody. Um, if you want to know more about what's happening down at Medelta, we have a lot of changing exhibitions that come and go throughout the year, so there's always something new going on. Lots of artists like Annette come in and they exhibit their work. We have lots of events going on, and you can find out all about that at our website, which is www.medelta.org. Uh, and while you're there, you can sign up for our e-newsletter as well, which goes out to over 3,600 people right now. and. Uh, uh, really gives you a lot of information on, on the exhibitions that are coming, the artists that are coming, and uh, everything that's going on down at Medelta. So thanks for watching. See you soon.